Hey, this is Jay. Happy Zer Day. Happy Friday. How in the world are you guys doing? Zer is at the tower over here on this left hand side. And as we're heading back here, just wanted to remind you that I released my weekly nightfall video. That's the one where I do with my son and subscribers like you. So if you want to check that out, just click on the link at the end of this video, or you can go to my channel page at any time. But also let me know too, do you have the Destiny 2 beta pre-downloaded already? You could start doing that yesterday. So hopefully you have that done and you're all ready to go. But here we go. All right, first up, we've got Legacy Ingrams. Uh, remember, you cannot infuse these current light levels. And uh, if you do buy something that has a current version available, you can go to the armor kiosk and buy that there. But uh, first up, we've got the Immolation Fist. This, of course, for your Titan. 78% stat roll, not very good. But uh, you get Accelerant, unlocks the Sunbreaker subclass node Explosive Pyre for free. Enemies brought down by your hammer explode, chaining fiery solar damage to other enemies. So I really don't use this too much. Uh, I wish there was a really good one for your hammer wielding Titan, uh, a good exotic, but there just isn't one. So yeah, I don't really care for this one. Uh, if I'm wrong though, or if I'm missing something, let me know that in the comments. But increased discipline, increased strength, rain blows, impact induction, hand cannon loader, and side iron loader. Next up, we've got the Crest of Alpha Loopy for your Hunter. This has an 82% stat roll, another bad one. Uh, Keeper of the Pack, revive fallen teammates, and be revived faster. Supers generate an extra orb. So this can be good if you're doing trials or something like that. That's, that would be about the only time that I actually use this. Maybe a Nightfall, uh, it could come in handy. But we've got increased strength, increased intellect, auto rifle loader, or auto rifle ammo, sniper rifle ammo, void burden defense, and void armor. Remember, um, these void burn defense and things like that, that can come in handy in the nightfall. Say the nightfall was void damage, you'll take less damage uh, if, if an enemy is using a void weapon. So uh, remember to check that out for your chest pieces. Alright, and then uh, for the Warlock, we've got the Starfire Protocol. This actually has a 92% stat roll, so not too bad. But you get Starfire Protocol, gain an additional fusion grenade. And that's it. Gain an additional fusion grenade for an exotic piece of armor. Uh, just not the greatest. I, I never use this. Uh, just, this needs something else. But we've got increased discipline, increased strength, special ammo, heavy ammo. That's great. Solar burn defense, that'll come in handy. Solar armor. So yeah, uh, that's it for the armor pieces. Uh, it could have given us something we don't have. And then we've got the Monte Carlo. This is a fun weapon to use. I love using it on my Hunter. Uh, but we get kinetic damage, and then we've got um, CQB ballistics, smart trip control, aggressive ballistics, uh, hip fire. This weapon has bonus accuracy while fires from the hip. Uh, high caliber round, send it, field scout, and then the Monte Carlo method. Dealing damage with this weapon reduces your melee cooldown and grants a chance to uh, fully charge your melee ability with each kill. So if you're th using your throwing knives or stink bombs or uh, anything, uh, what's the other grenade that kind of slows people down that I absolutely hate getting hit by? Uh, but yeah, this comes in handy. You get a kill and you can have that get recharged. So uh, it can be a lot of fun. But we got Super Spy looks pretty sweet royal flush uh, definitely like the super spy better but uh, that is what Zer had I mean why not give us um, oh that exotic heavy that we still haven't seen yet um, I don't know why they're holding that back especially when this life cycle is about done but uh, you can get the Suros regime with Basilisk's glory or the dragon's breath and tiger shark of course some upgrades for your sparrows, heavy ammo cakes, uh, three of coins, glass needles will let you reload those horrible stat rolls up here. Uh, you can trade in seven strange coins for an exotic shard or two for one mode of light. But that is what Xur has to offer. Let me know what you guys have going on this weekend. Uh, I've got a pretty uh, non-existent weekend as of the moment right now. I've got a funeral to go to today. Um, one of my friend's fathers passed away, so I'm not looking forward to that. But um, that's all I've got going on. Hope you guys have an awesome weekend. As always, take care and God bless.